How to type Pinyin text with tone marks in Windows? How do I type Chinese Pinyin text with the tone marks into any application in Windows? I am aware of the Chinese email in Windows, which converts Pinyin text I type into the Chinese stroked characters. This is not what I want. I want to type and view Pinyin text, like Richu for example, with all the proper tone marks, diacritics. The US international keyboard that comes with Windows makes typing some accents easy, but apparently not macrons, the bar over the U and Chu. The Mari keyboard has support for those, maybe you can hot switch between the two? Someone claimed to have made a derivative of the international keyboard that permits typing the macrons as well as other accents easily, but I haven't tried it out. You could try using a tone converter that takes in numeric based tones and spits out accent based tones. Edit. I found an explicitly pinion keyboard layout that should do what you want. May I suggest my own pinion tones email, which does exactly what the op was looking for. This URL. It's a Windows email that outputs pinion with tone marks, rather than Chinese characters. Type 1, 2, 3, or four after each syllable to add a tone mark, just as people have been entering pinions since the days of ASCII characters. Key features. Uses a text services framework, so it works everywhere that the Microsoft Pinion email works, including desktop and universal applications. Uses inline text composition, just like the Microsoft Times. This means that it behaves well in TSF aware applications, for example, when inserting, text will reflow as you type. Automatically places tone marks on the correct vowel in a combination, according to the rules of pinion orthography. For example, how 3 becomes how, with the tone mark on the a rather than on the o. You can use the keyboard layout creator to create such a keyboard layout yourself. Off the top of my head I don't know a layout which enables you to type all the tones. As Pabrad mentioned, you can't type a Macron on Us International, which is what I'm using here. But modifying Us International to add another dead key for Macron shouldn't be too hard. I've used a couple but in the end I went with Quick Pinyin because it's the only one that didn't need to be installed. This is kind of cool because I can run from a USB stick on any PC, for example, the library computers which don't let me install software on them. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Please contact us, Mr. Jingle.